So uh, it is the Thursday before Gen Con and I thought I would do things a little differently this time around um, to show you guys the panic and uh, preparations I go through. I fly out on Sunday morning and I thought I would do it a little differently this time and show you guys the lead up and preparation that I do the week before, at least half a week before I fly out. I am currently on my way to the Gen Con offices. They're based in Seattle, if you didn't know, and I live in Seattle. And uh, they are doing a Twitch stream today about tips for beginners coming to Gen Con, people that, tips and advice for people that have never been before. And I just shot a video about that. So they asked me if I wanted to come and take part and, you know, be, just be part of their Twitch stream today. And I thought that was really exciting. So I will take you guys with me. So I just finished work pretty much for the day. There's a couple of more emails I've got to send, but pretty much done with work. And uh, I go to Gen Con in a couple of days. It is Friday today. I know yesterday was a very short tip, but um, it's Friday, finished work. And we went to the mall like you just saw to get some supplies for Gen Con. So let me show you what we ended up picking up. I got this super cute t-shirt from a, a Steven Universe shirt from Hot Topic that has Sapphire and Ruby on it. For Derek, we went to JCPenney and we just got him a couple of work shirts that he can wear for Gen Con. And I went to Chic Shoes to pick up some boots for my cosplay that I'm doing at Gen Con. I wonder if you'll be able to pick up what the cosplay is gonna be. You're super cute. My hair is a little bit different from when you saw it yesterday. Yesterday it was blonde still, and today it's um, this purple color. It's a little patchy in parts because obviously sometimes the roots doesn't take quite as well as the rest of it. I've just had it in a braid because I didn't want to put too much heat on it, but. I think it'll be cute. Tomorrow is Saturday and then on Sunday morning we fly out to Indy to Gen Con. So usually I would do my first practice pack right now two days before we fly out to make sure like I have everything that I need on hand. But I actually need because my work has just been incredibly busy. So what I need to do right now is just a lot of chores. Uh, I need to do a bunch of laundry and some cleaning and stuff like that just so that I can actually get to everything and make sure I find everything I need but also when I go away on vacation or on a trip or something like that I like to come back to a house that is nice and tidy which if I pack right before my trip which if I pack right before my trip it ends up being like a hurricane hit it and a nightmare so if I do a lot of that tonight and get all my laundry done i can do my practice pack tomorrow morning or maybe later tonight and uh, yeah i'm just gonna do all the dishes clean all the counters there's a lot of trash that needs to be taken outside and just general tidying up and uh want to come with me and do chores <laughs> So 
while I'm doing chores and working really hard, and these two guys are here to do Gen Con stuff. Hi. 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 Introduce yourselves. I'm Derek. What do you, you do, might Derek? Also know me as Derek. I'm the event manager for Gen Con. And who are you? I'm Eric. What do you guys? I, I, so Gen Con is in too short a period of time. Like yep. four days or whatever. Mm -hmm. What are you guys? What are you guys working on? Uh, I'm working on the last minute stuff. Hey Eric, what are you doing? What do you do? Are you are you going to be a Gen Con? I am going to be a Gen Con. I'm working on the streaming events that are going on at Gen Con this year. So for the first time. Yeah. People I, people probably don't know about the streaming. Do you want to tell them what the, what to expect? Uh, we have two different types of streams. We're doing a full stage stream, um, four different RPGs a day for every every day of, at Gen Con. Um, people like Adam Colbo, Maze Arcana, uh, Travis McElroy, um, and a ton of other internet. Geek and Sundry. Geek and Sundry is coming to help out. Um, we've got Weave getting played, Dungeon World. Um, Ivan Van Norman's running Dread. Uh, we got a ton and ton of great um, RPGs being played. And then we also have um, another streaming um, channel, which is going to be just for our exhibitors to show off their products. And we've got some great hosts that are going to be talking with all the exhibitors. And I think it's seven exhibitors, seven to eight exhibitors a day that are going to be showed off. And uh, I think you're really going to enjoy it. Do you want to mention the URLs? I'll put them in the down bar too, but if people want to check that out. Yeah, it's uh, on Twitch. It's going to be official Gen Con, and then the exhibitor room is Gen Con Studio. Okay, thank Enjoy. you. Enjoy. We did the hair. It is now straight. We are doing chores. Uh, I'm almost done. I did all the bathrooms. I did the kitchen. I did all the recycling. I picked up around the place. I cleaned up the closet. The bed is just covered in stuff right now um, because I'm still waiting on the laundry to be done. So what I'm going to do is I have a big pile of clothes there, but I want to wait until laundry is done so I can see everything. So I'm going to pile it all up and then tomorrow morning I'll organize and choose what I'm going to pack and then I'll shoot a little video about everything that's going to be in my suitcase so you guys can see what I bring to Gen Con with me. And... Uh, yeah, just a little update. Derek, are you still working hard? Yes, I'm working hard. Gen Con's been great. Mm-hmm, I'm excited. Very proud of you. Thank you. You put together a lot of events. Mm-hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. Have fun. Enjoy the show. We are getting there. The bed, almost empty of stuff. I am so proud of that. Uh, the table and desk, just stuff that needs to be packed. Chair, clothes that are gonna be packed tomorrow. Laundry is still happening. So, I mean, things are moving slowly into the right direction. Um, it is midnight right now on, well, it's midnight Friday night. So we have all day tomorrow to finish up. Derek is playing some video games, well-deserved. <laughs> and uh, I found out that the prop for my cosplay is too big. It is uh, 38 inches and my suitcase is like 30 inches. So I stress, anxiety, last minute ordered a duffel bag suitcase that's 40 inches and it says it will arrive here tomorrow with one day shipping. And hopefully it does because if it doesn't, I'm letting somebody really down. Um, I really hope I don't let them down because we're doing a, a like a couple's group cosplay and I don't want to be they worked really hard on theirs so I really should make the effort us looks like our dryer is broken i think it's actually been going all night i don't know how it does that but it's been broken i mean the heating element i don't think works so it's spinning but it's not actually like heating up so it's not aggressively drying anything luckily our clothes are mostly dry by now 
but we live on this balcony thing and uh, I'm gonna put some of our clothes on this just over this so that they can dry in the heat because it's been really warm and uh, dry in Seattle but it's nasty because we live right beside this big ass tree and it deposits all this bullshit so I've been uh, scrubbing it down to clean it it's been a while since anybody has done that <laughs> excited what okay i know see this is my excited face but what what uh adventure did we have on our journey here oh they already saw that part oh but we're back on the road yeah we're back yep Monster. oh yes we're going to pick up kill team at mox boarding house we're here Sporting house. What'd you get? What is it? Kill team. The new like squad skirmish size 40k. Which one do you care about? Those guys. The red ones? Yeah. Are you happy? Very. Oh. Hi Pete, you're gonna Hello. be in my video. No. It's looking after our cats. <laughs> you guys are so cute. <laughs>
tell you guys that I have an event in the Gen Con system now. Uh, it's like a meet and greet with me. It's just because a lot of people on here sometimes say that they hope they're going to run into me. I always feel sad when I don't because I want to say hi to you guys because uh, you are the people that I make these videos for. And I just want to say hi and thank you guys for watching them and that I appreciate it. So the middle of meeting grade at 6 p.m. on Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Um, the location is always in the Lucas Oil Stadium. There's ticket in the system. I'm going to like do a little flash up of what that looks like. And uh, maybe I'll see you guys there. It's going to be super casual. It's essentially just like come join me. We'll play a, a quick co-op game. I have I'm going to have a couple with me that we can play. And it's just an excuse to say hi and hang out. So uh, last night, remember I told you that the prop I have for my cosplay is too big for the suitcases that we have. So I emergency ordered a suitcase on Amazon that should fit it, no problem. And they said guaranteed delivery by 9 p.m. today. And it's now 8 p.m. and I'm kind of panicking that um, that it won't arrive in time. So I, a friend of mine told me that he has a suitcase that will fit it. So I'm emergency driving to their house right now to see if it'll fit and borrow it from them if I need to. And uh, it's a little bit scary. It's gonna be like a, a lovely like hour and a bit round trip. So I'm not super looking forward to that, but gotta do what you gotta do. So uh, wish me luck. So I am back home. It is 10 p.m. And uh, my friend's bag did not fit the thing. They didn't measure it, so it doesn't fit. And that gave me 10 minutes to try and get to a local sporting goods store before 9 p.m. to see if I could find a bag there. And they had one, but it's really soft. It looks like this. So as you can see, that's just... It's just a piece of cloth and the prop is made from like foam and stuff. So anything dings it, it's just gonna break. So that's great. And the item did not get delivered and now it says, sorry, we're running late. So I just contacted Anabson support and just tore into them because they're just bullshit and they're crap and they're garbage. And hey, at least they refunded me and stopped the order and give me five dollars credit for my for my inconvenience of having to sit here all day by the door for like me wasting my whole day waiting for it and then driving all the way to north seattle and back into sports stores and spend extra money and just be stressed all day so i'm just with that going wrong and Derek's car breaking and then my car stalling out and or dryer breaking and everything I'm just kind of spent I realized I wasn't taking my own advice I was letting uh, some pretty crappy things get me down but my own advice was to be open-minded and flexible and just get excited for Gen Con because Gen Con is where my friends are and no matter what happens I'm gonna hang out with them and I'm gonna have the best time. So even though my dryer's broken, my car ran out of batteries, Derek's car is dead, and our dryer died, and the thing with the bag, you know what, it all seems terrible, but it is now like midnight, half past midnight, and in about 10 hours, I'm gonna be on a flight to like the best thing that's gonna happen all year, so what am I complaining about?